welcome to another episode of Is It Expired? A.K. people will bitch and moan and say, Why is there a car? Man, you're in a car! Oh my god, you can't break the rules, man. We are trying something. Now, I bought this a long, long time ago. And I'm just now getting around to it. I actually pulled this out from uh, when I was doing my Tuesday weekly Twitch stream. So you can go down in the description for the link to that. Uh, we do at uh, 5 p.m. usually Pacific Standard Time. I do uh, miscellaneous twitching. So I would come and join in the fun and whatnot. Uh, but this is the Seven Deadly Sins gum. And it's anger, greed, pride, envy, lust, sloth, and gluttony. Isn't one of them, isn't it, it's not anger, right? Isn't it wrath? But I don't know, maybe that's, uh, no, I think that is it. Um, I'm not big on religion, obviously. I'm not a religious person in any way, shape, or form. But hey, do what makes you happy as long as you're not forcing your shit down somebody else's goddamn hole. Now, I know uh, our friend The Review Spot did a video on this a long time ago. His is the video that has, like, all the views on it. And, uh, I did watch his review. He said that they all tasted the same. I'm hoping that they are not. I'm gonna do the best one here. Pride, baby. Fuck yeah. Because that's the best one. Hands down. It's pride. Because that's... I'm the best. I am the best. Oh, they've got like a little like... I don't know who the hell that is. I have no... I have no... I have to cover up my face so you can see it properly. I don't know there's a little demon back there and there's some chick. The demons... He's looking pretty lax. He kind of looks like the uh, little imp from Morrowind that you could trick into selling or buying all your shit. And there was like a there was like a trick you could do, huh, where you can go back to him. He was like he was the merchant with the most money in the land. So there's two of these. They don't look like they held up very well. They've got little like black things on them. But let's try it out. Still have good bubble gum flavor. No, it's like not bad. It's bland generic gum, but it tastes okay. Okay, let's do the next one. Greed. It's another one of my personal favorites. So, uh, oh, you do YouTube? You go, oh, you greedy, you greedy bastard. It's another, like, old-timey woman on the back. I don't understand why she would be greed. Uh, and another little devil dude over there. All right, well, whatever. They have little, like, it looks like they're Bible verses that are in the inside. I'm not going to bother doing that. It's the same exact gum, uh, so I think he was right, so we're not even going to bother. Um, and they are all the same gum, then. I mean, that's what he said in his review, so I trust him. It's an interesting concept because you're going to sell these to kind of like the super hardcore, crazy religious people, but then you're also going to sell them to people like me where it's a good curiosity. Uh, I don't, I doubt they still sell this. I would be really surprised if they do. I know it's like Archie, is Archie McPhee? I think it's a place you don't have around here, but they have it out in Seattle when I went out there and uh, it, it was a really cool gimmick shop, like lots of interesting things that you can buy there. But it just like, what the hell are you going to do with this now? There's no way this lasted years. Uh, if they still sell it, if you've seen places still sell this gum, let me know in the comments down below. I don't think it expired. It tastes fine. It did look like it didn't age well physically. The little black dots and stuff on it, that's probably a sign that you shouldn't be touching this to put it in your mouth, but I did anyway. Oh, well. It's still not a bad idea. Gimmick's fun. Tastes like generic bubble gum, and it held up pretty well. So there you go, guys. That is my review on that. Make sure to check out our Twitch account down below. The link is in the description. Give us a follow on there and join us every Tuesday for our adventures. And thank you so much for watching. We'll see you on the next episode.